We start with breaking news this morning out of central Columbia after police say a shooting left multiple people injured. Thanks for joining us on this Sunday morning. I'm Eric McGuire. We'll get right to your out the door forecast in just a moment. But first, let's check in with ABC 17's Joshua Blount, who joins us live from Business Loop 70, where that shooting took place this morning. And Josh, police say they responded to shots fired around 2.15 this morning. Erica, good morning. Yeah, I've been on the business. I've been in the, on the business loops um, scene here behind me since about 2:30 this morning. And at this point, CPD is just working to investigate what happened here. Now, as I move out the way, you can just see that the scene is still active. You see several officers out. You know, just like I said, investigating that scene. At one point, I spoke to the um, I spoke to the uh, PIO who tells me that they have crime scene invest investigators here, detectives, as well as they brought their drone out at one point to do some investigating as well. Now, CPD. Um, spokesman Christian Tayback tells me officers responded to report of shots fired in the 900 block of Business Loop. Tayback also says that multiple people are injured. Upon arriving to the scene, Columbia Police Department says officers located evidence of gunshots. Since I've been here on the scene, I saw at least six evidence markers spread out across the parking lot and police searching the parking lot with flashlights. There's also crime scene. As I mentioned, there's also crime scene investigators here. Now, Xander Zamora tells me he was at work inside the Thirsty Turtle when he heard about eight gunshots and tells me he doesn't feel safe. I mean, it's a shooting right where I work. Um, I feel like it could happen to me, you know, if it's so close to me, you know, why wouldn't it? It's dangerous. And Erica CPD is asking the community to avoid the area. However, they did say that they don't believe it's any immediate threat to the public. Now, we'll continue just to be on scene and investigating here. Reporting live from Columbia, Joshua Blount, ABC 17 News. All right, Josh, thank you for that report this morning. Now, police say there is no suspect information at this time. And once we learn more, we'll be sure to bring you any updates on air and online at ABC17news.com.